What's up, Eggheads? Kenan here with New Egg Now, where we bring you the best tech for the best prices. In this segment, we're talking about one of my favorite things, gaming mice. Specifically, the Deluxe M627 Dual Wireless or Wired Left or Right Hand Gaming Mouse. I've said it before and I'll say it again, a mouse is one of the most important components for a gaming system because it's one of the things, it's basically the only thing that translates your actual decisions into the game. When you're navigating, aiming, shooting, etc., precision and accuracy are crucial. Even with low ping, a bad mouse will ruin your gameplay. You need good resolution, something that's comfortable. Anyway, you get the idea, let's open the box. All right, so I've just taken this from the outside sleeve and it already feels super premium. So let's open it and uh, wow, as I open this, okay, just take a look at that. What a presentation. It looks like something Alfred would present to Batman. All right, so anyway, here we go. You've got your mouse and uh, underneath everything, you're gonna find a USB cable, user manual and CD for drivers. Although you can download the drivers as well. What's all this stuff you might ask? These are customizable side wings and side weights. All right, so I don't wanna waste your time using all of the attachments super extensively. I'll try to go as quickly as I can. But basically, you could, of course, use the mouse straight away like so. It's got an ambidextrous design, suitable for both right hand and left hand use. In my opinion, that's already super cool. It's got eight buttons. You've got left and right hand click two front and back buttons on both sides, making that super easy for both right or left hand users. You've got the scroll wheel and the DPI switch. Okay, but what about the attachments? This is where it gets really interesting. Okay, we got uh, left and right side covers, each two grams each. It's really cool that you know the exact weight. They attach really easily, they detach really easily. You've also got left or right hand rests each six grams. They would go on like so. If you want that pinky holder, that's gonna be really comfortable. All right, each six grams. And you also have left or right side counterweights. Counterweights, each 6.5 grams. This right here is the uh, USB dongle, uh, 2.4 gigahertz USB dongle for wireless. So that is really awesome. They've provided us with so much stuff. So you can be pretty darn guaranteed that no matter how you like your mouse, you're gonna be able to get it with this one. And better yet, change the mouse ever so slightly, perhaps for different scenarios. Maybe different games require different sensitivities. Or, you know, if you buy a new mouse pad and realize that it's starting to slide too easily, you can add a counterweight. That's awesome. And it's gonna add great shelf life to your product and therefore saves you hard-earned dollars. Ergonomics, check. The Deluxe M627 has a Pro PNW3389 gaming sensor. That's gonna give you up to 16,000 DPI. That's your resolution, your dots per inch. Gives you 400 IPS. That's tracking speed inches per second. You get 50G acceleration and a 1000 Hertz refresh rate. It's got the USB cord, but also stable wireless with a built-in rechargeable lithium ion battery. You can use that 2.4 gig USB dongle uh, for a lag-free connection at a one millisecond report rate and up to 50 hours of use on a single charge, 50 hours. And of course, you get the standard Pro Gamer 16 million RGB color options with a DPI indicator light as well. You can use the included software or download the software drivers to customize the lighting and it's compatible with Windows 7, 8, or 10. All right, everyone, this honestly is a god of a gaming mouse. It's got everything and more. 16 million RGB color, DPI up to 16,000. To put simply, it's wireless or wired. It's left or right. It's light or heavy. It's either in your house or not. My dear eggheads, the Deluxe M627 Gaming Mouse. For specific prices, please check the description or click the link below. This has been New Egg Now, and now you know. What's up, eggheads? Kenan here with New Egg Now, where we bring you the top shelf products for the low ball prices. In this segment, we're looking at the Orico 4 port USB 3.0 hub clamp. 
All right, Orico wasting no materials in here, giving us exactly what we need. We've got the instruction manual, the info card, USB cable, and the USB hub clamp. It's got a really cool design, check that out. You've got an aluminum magnesium alloy body, premium quality, super durable. Because of this metallic combo, you're gonna get rapid heat dissipation, which honestly is more of just an interesting factoid as USB cables won't typically heat up too much. Uh, but anyway, it's super eye-catching. It's gonna save you a lot of desk space and hassle because of the clamp. All right, this is gonna allow you to attach it to the edge of any desk, to the side of a computer monitor, whether you're using a desktop or a laptop. If you say, Kenan, whoa, why would I clamp that to my laptop screen? Wouldn't that damage my screen? Trust me, I had the exact same concern. And then upon closer inspection, I noticed this rubber backing on the inside edge. All right, so it won't scratch anything you clamp it to. Let me attach it to this monitor right here so we can see it at work. All right, so we are at full speed ahead here. I've got the Orico USB 3.0 hub clamp attached to the side of my monitor. It's plugged in as well, as you can see by the blue indicator light. Okay, that is telling us that we have four USB ports ready to go. Any flat edge surface between 0.39 and 1.26 inches is gonna work. All right, this is perfect for most tabletops and a lot of monitors. Now, if your laptop is something like a MacBook Air or something similar to that, the screen will probably be too thin. You're gonna to wanna to check your specs to make sure it's at least 0.39 inches wide. But this is great, right? You're gonna free up a lot of important working space. You won't have to stick a USB hub on the desk, right? You've added four USB 3.0 ports quickly and easily. They're all plug and play, hot swappable ports of course, and yes, backwards compatible with older USB versions. I think in an era where we need many USB devices at once, such as printers, mice, keyboards, external devices, you know, card readers, having this expansive capability is obviously very important. Any hub lets us do that, of course. But this clamp hub gives us more flexibility in where we want the ports to be. They can be low on the monitor like this, they can be high up, they can be on the side of the table. It's gonna work with any Windows, Mac, or Linux computer. It's compatible with most devices, such as phones, tablets, USB foot massagers, and whatnot. You know, and if you do have to attach high power devices, it does have a power supply port, all right? So portable hard drives and the like will need you to make good use of that power supply port. Orco really has thought of everything here. In a tiny, yet extremely durable and fashionable device, you've got four high-speed, five gigabit per second USB 3.0 ports. An extra port for a power supply too, meaning any USB device under the sun can be attached to this thing. And we can attach it almost anywhere as well. Tabletops, desktops, monitors, bedside tables. You know, are you ever in a coffee shop stuck working on one of those really tiny tables? There's barely enough room for your coffee? Fear not. Clamp this to the side of the table or to your computer monitor and free up the space for your Frappuccino or more importantly, your actual work. It's gonna be compatible with Windows, Mac, and Linux. So I'd say it brings a lot of value for the price. For up-to-date pricing, please check the description or click the link below. The Orico Clamp Design 4-Port USB 3.0 Hub. I'm Kenan from Newegg Now, and now you know. What's up, eggheads? How are you? Kenan here with Newegg Now, bringing you the best products for the best prices. As you can see here, I've got the beautiful looking Avagon Glyph Founders Edition headset, a device that truly encapsulates personal entertainment. It can be worn upright if you're just listening to music, or rotated down 90 degrees if you wanna use the built-in screen for watching a movie. So in that way, the Glyph Founders Edition brings studio quality audio and high fidelity imagery as close to your senses as physically possible. Let's go ahead and take a closer look. You'll find that the box is meticulously well packaged, always get points for that, what we are supplied with. We got the headset itself, Okay, we'll get to that very soon. We've got an A to D HDMI cable, a micro USB cable for charging. We get a really cool carrying bag, okay, if you wanna take it traveling. A set of nose bridges, 
All right, this is gonna be very important, especially for the personal theater mode. We all have different sized noses, so they thought of that. We've got a quick start guide, a lens wipe, and a strap if you need to make uh, the video mode more secure. When we tilt the Glyph Founders Edition headset down 90 degrees, we initiate personal theater mode. Inside the headset, you've got a built-in 720p HDMI display. You can use it for anything that a standard screen can be used for. You can use it as a monitor for your computer. You can use it as a screen for your smartphone. You can connect it to your home theater, play console games, etc. To get it set up, it's gonna take a little bit of effort and time because we've got all, you know, all of us have different shaped faces, noses, eyes, and all of our eyes have different prescriptions. You're gonna feel a little bit like an optometrist getting this set up. Step one, we remove the optical cover. Okay, check this out. This is what you're gonna see on the inside. We remove the optical cover and reveal the eyepieces and the slot for the nose bridge in the center. Once you figure out which nose bridge is comfortable for you, let's say I've chosen this one, I'm gonna turn the center knob. You'll see it starts to move down. Here we go. I'm gonna be able to move, remove the placeholder bridge and connect mine. Connect the nose bridge that I want, like so. There we go. Okay, step one complete. Nose bridge in place. Okay, next you'll press this center button and the lenses will pop out. Let's have a look. See that? Lenses have popped out. You have to adjust the interpupillary distance sliders on the top. That's right here. You see we can adjust the distance of the lenses. You're gonna have to uh, match the width between your eyes. And then you'll fine tune the focus by twisting the lenses themselves. The headset will accommodate a wide range of myopia and hyperopia, from negative seven up to plus one. This means that even most people who need glasses can use the headset without having to also wear their glasses. When you power on the headset, there will be a default screen, and that's what you can watch while you adjust the settings to make sure you get it perfectly right. This entire process is a little tedious, maybe even, <laughs> maybe even a little frustrating, right? Because we, we just wanna watch our movies, but, when you finally get a crisp, crystal clear image, and you most certainly can, it is 100% worth it. It won't be worth your time or your money unless you fine tune it to perfection, and then it's great. The controls are built in quite seamlessly. On the outside surface of the right earpiece, you've got volume and brightness, and then you can toggle head tracking or VR mode using the switches on the left earpiece. Now, I don't have any way to let you experience what the video looks like unless you try the headset yourself. I've tried to photograph it, I, I just, photograph it, I just can't. I'm pretty sad about that. You're just gonna have to try to believe everything I tell you. So I will be straight up with you. What you get is a 16 by nine rectangle that looks pretty darn good. Now I said VR and head tracking just now, but it's not fully immersive because you're still able to see the outside world of the headset uh, with just a little bit in your field of view. So for people who need a 100% immersive headset, this is not the one. But for watching movies or using this as an awesome personal screen, it's perfect. If you need to, you're still able to access your phone on the side for texting perhaps, maybe pet your cat or dog, or just see if someone needs to talk to you. Immerse yourself in your favorite content without being completely cut off from your surroundings. You'll also get pretty substantial battery life with the Glyph when you consider what it's doing. You've got a 2000 milliamp hour battery that's rated for four hours of usage. I ran two tests and that's exactly what I got, plus or minus just a few minutes. For displaying movies and listening to audio, that's a decent amount of life. You can use it while it charges too, and it'll fully charge in just three hours if it's not in use. So that's basically it, everyone. The sad thing about personal entertainment experiences is that it's very hard to fully share. You have to try it yourself. But Avagant has done a really good job here. For a pretty low price, you get a personal movie theater, a second computer screen, a great audio headset, all in one good looking, high build quality body. You get a 720p DLP display, giving you a crystal clear, bright image, no matter what your natural vision is, no matter how big or small your nose is, right? We've all got the macro and micro adjustments necessary to get it just perfect. 
For video, it connects via HDMI, either directly or through an adapter. For audio, just use the audio port. In one full charge, you get enough juice for two standard length films. Or use it while it charges and don't worry about the battery at all. It'll most certainly be a well-appreciated gift or a great addition to your personal home theater. And I think the price actually has come down considerably. I know these things used to be many, many hundreds of dollars and I think it's way down. For the most current pricing, please check the description or click the link below. I'm excited to see what you think of this one. Let us know in the review section. And that's all folks, the Avagant Glyph Founders Edition headset. I'm Kenan, this has been Newegg Now, and now you know. Hey there, guys, how are you? I'm Kenan, one of your product hosts here at Newegg Now, where we bring you the best products for the lowest prices. In this segment, we're taking a gander at the Way and When 4D Shaver. All right, I care about your time, so let's get right to the unboxing. In the box, as you probably guessed, we have our shaver. Here it is, stylish and light. It'll look good in any bathroom for sure. Also provided a USB cable, all right, for charging, and a tiny brush to help clean the mess from the blades when the deed is done. Shaving in theory is pretty simple, right? We want an even shave, a close shave, and we want it to be comfortable. Well, this has a four direction floating head design. Four directions, of course, being up, down, right, and left. It's also got a three dimensional rotary shaver head that'll follow every contour of the face and remain in close contact with the skin. All right, so that is going to deliver a fast, gentle, and complete shave. As far as timing goes, you definitely have nothing to worry about. The Way and When 40 Shaver offers triple the shaving time. All right, so how many minutes of shave time do you think you'll get for this? 20 minutes? 40 minutes? Well, if you said 60 minutes, you're still wrong because this gets up to 100 minutes of shaving time. That's crazy. The rechargeable lithium ion battery delivers the power of a corded shaver without the hassle of a cord. Charge it in any place, any time. Charges in about an hour and yes, up to 100 minutes. So, you know, shaving only takes a few minutes. You could travel for a few weeks, shave every day and be good with just one charge. And if that wasn't good enough, it's also waterproof. So whether you want a wet shave or a dry shave, it's all okay. You've got a fully washable design for easy cleaning. Let me pop off the top so you can see. Bingo, there we are. Get a close up on that. Okay, let me put that back on. Pretty simple. So that's all folks. The Way & When 4D Shaver. It's good looking, it's waterproof, so if you shave dry or shave wet, you're good to go. You get that four directional, three dimensional shave, making sure everything stays close, smooth, and comfy. You get up to 100 minutes of shaving time. I just think that's insane. With any shaver, of course, if your skin is super sensitive, you probably want to use a gel or a foam when you shave, but this is going to be perfectly fine dry as well. For specific pricing, please check the description or click the link below. I'm Kenan with Newegg Now, and now you know.